Hello everyone, it's Eve from Silver Haired Gaming, back with another episode of the Farmer's Market, and today, I'm all suited up, got all my tools, got my inventory emptied, we're going to have a journey to the nether and see if we can find some blaze rods and just harvest some stuff that I might need in here, and I'm hoping I don't die. <laughs> so, we're going to go, I put the, um, I put a nether portal, I didn't turn it on yet, but I built one down here in uh, one of the upper shafts that I'd uh, built and I can I contained it so zombie pigman won't be driving or walking all around the the uh, the farm Boop. okay so cross your fingers guys here we go yay oh cool and I'm in a semi-confined space which I did not... Oh, but I'm right around Soul Sand. Oh, this stinks. Because uh, you know what I didn't bring? I didn't do what I always do. And that is... I did not bring cobblestone to make a little <laughs> dwelling around it. <clears throat> and that's usually my MO. It's kind of like my stock thing to do. So we're going to run back really quick. And we're going to grab a bunch of cobblestones to make it blast-proof in the nether. <laughs> I don't know why I forgot to do that. Um... I know why, because I was trying to empty as much inventory space as possible. So let's scoot over here and grab ourselves um, uh, two stacks. Oops. Two stacks? Yeah, that'll be enough. Okay, so. Take two. <coughs> let's try it out now. And you do zip around this. I'm, I'm liking this exosuit, and I'm thinking I might make some of those other different kinds of pl uh, plates. Uh, according to the to the book, I should have made brass plates because they're they kind of help you if you fall in lava a little bit. But I didn't take time and did it. <sighs> Probably should have, but I didn't. Oh, first things first. Let's get rid of this soul sand. I mean, you know, it has its place, just not around my nether portal. You know, so this just slows me down. Although it's not too bad with this exosuit on because it makes me go faster. I'm actually not slowed down all that much. It makes up for it. It's kind of like walking normal, I guess. Which is interesting. <laughs> Hello, creepy souls. I'm sorry you've been trapped in the sand. And I'm hoping... I want to see what that ore is up there. Because if I want to make more ammunition for my musket, I'm going to need some extra gunpowder and although I'm probably going to end up making a mob farm eventually with mine factory reloaded um, there's other ways to make it um, like with was it niter? not niter well we'll look at it and see what it is I'll harvest what I can harvest and what I can get my hands on while I'm here and luckily I'm not I didn't come out in a really open area, so I guess I won't really have to deal with ghasts all that much. Actually, just get rid of this stuff. Yeah, and this ash is actually a way to make more charcoal. If you combine all these ash piles um, into charcoal, or you combine them together, it makes charcoal. So you don't have to uh, burn trees or whatever. So I can use that. If needs be, it can be a way to harvest some more free... Uh, or free charcoal for my steam power, for my boilers and stuff. And eventually I want to make an endothermic pump because, I don't know, I feel like I, you just need lava sometimes. It, um, if anything, to make uh, my... Uh, ah! Come on, get up there. To make a magma crucible so I can make all the... Um, all the obsidian I want, or stone, or whatever. And it's just a resource that I don't have to grab from a bucket and fill a tank and bring it back if I need it for whatever reason. Here, you know, I'm not going to have enough to finish. Well, I think this is probably going to be good enough for now. And then we're going to go exploring. So let's see if we can find... Alright, ooh, that's... uh. This stuff, if you fall on it, you'll, it'll set you on fire. So I want to try to avoid that as much as possible. Let's 
executing. Oh, look at that. Got Ardite and Cobalt right away. All right, well, that's cool. These are the uh, Nether Ores from Tinker's Construct that make the most uh, powerful alloy. So while I'm here, I'm going to grab this stuff. That's cool. Normally, this stuff ends up being, well, kind of hard to find. At least I always end up having issues finding it, it seems. Hello there, Mr. Lava Pit. I do not want to fall down to you. Ah! Okay. The first thing I did was fall down. Okay. Ow! <laughs> Alright. And I wanted to go see what this is. Nether iron ore. Oh, okay. I forgot I must have nether ores on. What is that awful noise? <laughs> is this dense? It's dense ores. Yep. Dense iron ore. I was hoping it was, uh, and I can't remember what it's called. I have to look it up. I think there's other ores in the, uh, now let's look here. Alright, so it looks like there is, so it should be just south of me. Yeah. See some of those long, um, let's see, let's turn around and see if we can find it over here. Actually, it looks like there's one right over there. All right, so let's head this way. No, oh, and I instantly went into the lava. Jeez Louise. Well, this protected me fairly well from it, too. I think those are hellhounds I'm hearing. They're a scary thing from witchery, but uh, I might need them later. Poor witchery stuff. So at least I know they're here. God, the nether is a horrible place to be. Aha! Perfect! Look at that! Alright, now somewhere around here. Alright, cool. Took me right into it. You know what I need to do? Ay, ay, ay. Sometimes I do not remember things well. What did I forget? Does anyone remember? I need a waypoint. <laughs> so I don't... <laughs> so I know how to get back. Because I've done this so many times. Home. Home. Home is a happy place that I do want to come back to. Ah! There we go. Okay, so. Let's get our sword out, because now that we're in a... We never know what kind of baddies are going to come our way. More cobalt? More cobalt. Yay! It's so cool. And I'll take the iron. Why not? Okay, that is... My headphones are screaming at me right now. Because... I have to turn the volume down. Because <laughs> those monsters are so loud in my head right now. It's ridiculous. Hostile creatures. Let's just turn you down to like... Five. Maybe I don't need to turn the master volume down. They are just screaming. Okay, that's much better. <laughs> I can still hear them, but they're not, like, <laughs> burning a hole in my ear. Whoa, hello, Blazes! Well, success! All right. I'm, I'm hoping that achievement means I got a blaze powder out of all that mess. Wow, that is really lucky. I did. I got four. Look at that. I got some sulfur and some powder. Okay, well, I cannot believe I spawned so close to a blaze spawner. That's amazing. <laughs> they did do some damage to me, though. I do need some fire protection, apparently. Is that a bad guy up there? Yeah, it is. That's oh, just a zombie pig man. He and I are friends. We're going to be friends. Oh, boy. I need, what this tells me is that when I come here, I need to get into some Batania work to make some baubles to help uh, with fire protection. Because, um, you know, that's really... Or I need to just start making some potions. Wow, so many are spawning here at once. Let's just camp it out, I guess. Some Ardite right there. Man, this place is awesome. This is the best nether I've ever been to. <laughs> Die. What do I have now? I got six. I, I don't know. I want to get a good bit, I guess. I'm 
also going to harvest that art before I leave. And I'm not going to stick around like for a wither or anything. Like, oh, wow, the four of them spawn at once. That is nuts. And the other thing that's lo semi lucky, at least, is that a lot of times they spawn in like an open area, so they um, drink again. So a lot of times they fly away; they're hard to get. But th these guys are, you know, more or less contained in there. Um, so that's good. Eight. I'm gonna get a couple more. Let's get at least four more. More of you at spawn. I like this sword, man. This broadsword was a good choice. Oh, there's a spirit. Now, last time I actually killed one, I got something called ectoplasm. Yeah, which I gotta find out. It's from random things. I, I really don't know anything about it, but I, I'm guessing it does something. You go kill them before they can shoot me. Still, none of them are dropping. So come on, come on, come on, come on. I'll take four at a time. I'm not afraid. Any day now, guys. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, little blazies. Come on, little blazies. Come on. There we go. Thank you. Thank you. Neither. Oh, come on, guys. You can do better than that. Apparently, while I'm standing here, I can at least grab this Ardite. There we go. So I got four and seven. All right. I might look around for more. And I can, uh,. Yeah, upgrade my tools, I guess, if I get enough of it. I don't know, we'll see. Wow, he just popped right in front of my face. Can I get another one? I got one more. Okay, cool, we're getting there. Come on. Blazy, 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 blazies. See, there's another one not too far to my east, I see, over there on the mini-map. It's worth investigating. No, no, I haven't done anything with magical crops, but the fact that, uh... I can grow blaze rods instead of having to do this all the time is a luring prospect to me. I think I got a red heart there. Yeah, I did. Cool. Oh, hello. There we go. There's another one. All right, two more. Two more. Come on, guys. Let's go. Two more. Two more. Two more. Please, 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 please. <clears throat> if I wanted to get into Ender IO, I could actually just take this spawner, but eh. I did that last time, so I might just leave it. If I get desperate, I could do that too. I could turn this into a uh, a mob farm. Boom, boom, boom. Come here, you. Oh, it's great. It's a, it's a, it's a. Oh, good. Well, that was bad. That was a boss one. Did you see that? <laughs> okay. All right. Stop standing around. I got twelve. Okay. So let's go over here for a second, and let's heal up a little bit. What I might do is, and this might be genius. Well, I don't know about genius. Hey, hey, I didn't attack you. Why are you attacking me? <gasps> no! Why did he attack me? Big mean man. All right, well, luckily it's not far from <laughs> from the portal. Oh, I'm moving so slow now. <laughs> Let's grab my end sword and see if I can get my crap back without dying. Um, wish me luck. Here we go. <laughs> I don't know why he attacked me. I didn't attack any pigmen. Unless that, that, uh, that boss blaze, like, did something to trigger him. I swear I didn't hit anybody I wasn't supposed to hit. I swear, pigmen, you and I, we are friends. We are friends. I mean you no harm, I promise. You gotta get that stuff back. The whole point I went there. I don't, I don't know. There's something about the Nether that really, just uh, I always do. I always get killed in the Nether. It's it's my least favorite place to be. I really wish there was like super high end armor that was like made you impenetrable to fire in the Nether, so there's no way you can die. Then I guess it would be. Well, okay. I don't want to hurt you. I don't want to hurt you. Dropped a bunch of nuggets and gold. That's good. There's going to be more spawns of blazing up here. Yep, that's going to kill me. I didn't bring any food! Silly man. 
Why did I have to die up there? Why couldn't I have died down here where I could have gotten to it? Come here. Ow, that's gonna kill me. I'm gonna die again. <laughs> okay. So <clears throat> now both sets of armor. I was burnt to a crisp while fighting a blaze. That's that's about as accurate as you can get. Okay, so let's make some. F well, actually, I have some food already. I got these pies. Ah, I don't want to take that with me. Let's eat some pumpkin pie. Okay, I gotta think this out. Uh, let's see. I can make some more armor, or do I? I don't have any laying around. I don't think. Oh boy, oh boy. This is. See, I hate the Nether so much. <laughs> I really do hate it so so much. It's my least favorite thing. I don't have anything in here, do I? Oops. No, I don't. So, let's see. Did I have any that I looted that I haven't used yet in here? Probably not. No. So, I'm just going to have to make some make some more. Maybe I'll maybe I'll make some steel armor cuz that'll be better than iron. Do I have any how much steel do I have left over if any? About ten. Well, that's not gonna be enough <coughs> to make a whole set. Let's. Well, okay. So if I make, uh, yeah. If I make, so if I make fourteen more steel, I can make a complete set of steel armor. It's weird. I, I'm. Used to walking so much faster now. So I need 20, 28 coal to do this. And we will make ourselves. Uh, wait for that to do its thing. Wow. See, I really should have prepared for this. And I totally didn't. I'm going to go back and let's make some food. So, you know what? Let's dip into Pam's Harvest Craft for just a moment to see what kind of fun food I can make with all the stuff I've got. Now that I've got all this stuff, I should be able to make something interesting. Uh, let's see, raw beef. I can make meat pies. I don't have pepper yet. I could make a plain hamburger. Huh. Beef Wellington. Oh, that's fancy. Raw chicken. I can. T oh, mutan dessin. I can make sure. Maple sausage. I don't have the spices yet. I can make jerky. <gasps> oh, well, that's simple. And I've got plenty of salt. All right, well, let's make just a little bit of jerky then. I can do that. I'm actually a, a big jerky fan in real life, for those of you who don't know. So we'll make some jerky. I bet it's it's like the best traveling food, you know, because it's compact. It uh, keeps easy. And uh, <laughs> it's all protein, so it's good for you, for those of you. I'm going to need another, oh man, I really wish I had that cobalt and ardite right now, so I could make a cool sword. I'm going to have to make a bland, oh, wait, I have enough, hold on, protection's the problem, I have enough, I think, I had some extra of that, yeah, dark steel, so I can make another, I should be able to make another end sword, or whatever they call it, the ender? Ender, there we go. All right, and it's it's pretty, it's decent. It's not powered or anything, but it'll do as far as a base weapon will go. Let's see how, you, how how are you doing over here? Oh, there you go. Almost done with the first phase. Phase one almost complete. And then I'm just gonna make steel. I was looking at elementium, which is another alloy that uh, with Batania. I might get into. Oh, it looks kind of cool. There's also a Terra steel, which I might get into. I don't know, Batania is one thing I do want to get to uh, later on in Witchery, and they're more mystical and uh, more magic-based. Um, but they're kind of, you know, if you know anything about Wiccan and stuff like that, it's all about kind of like Mother Nature and Earth, so it uh, makes kind of sense. You know what, I can just go ahead and... Oh, I'm not doing it. Duh. Here I am. Dust. I got dust? I should get a hammer then. Yeah, or a sieve. That's right. 
because I can get free stuff out of it. What was I pulverizing that I got dust from? I don't remember. Uh, Ex Nilio is something I can get into, too. It's, it was really intended for... Um, put that away over here for now. It was really intended for a specific uh, mod pack <coughs> called Agrarian Skies or Sky Factory, which is kind of fun, which I've never done. I might end up doing a series of that if I can get... Um, a buddy of mine to play online. We got to get a server going for it. Um, that's a lot of fun. It basically, you start in the sky with nothing but like a three by three square of dirt and one tree, and you have to rebuild the world from that. It's really fun how it works. You got to make dirt. <laughs> you got to make everything from scratch. And the way to do it is by getting that dust. Um, gives you random bits of, uh, you know. Uh, metals that you'd normally get. Alright, come on. Come on. Come on. Let's get started on this smelting. Da, 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 da. Oh, let's grab the other steel I had. I'm gonna get mad at myself later for using up all the steel for this. I'm gonna say, where's all my steel when I go to make another machine? And, alas, I will have to remember, it's, that's right, I went to the nether. so quick. I don't do this very often. I'm not using these machines all that much, but when I do, ugh, it's slow. The thermal expansion machines are already, I think, def by default pretty quick, but these uh, these mechanism ones... Oh, shoot, fire. I just made two different steels. Craptastic. <laughs> I don't think it'll screw me up too bad. I should still be able to make what I need to make. We're going to find out here. Alright, so... There's no recipe for armor? Is there a mechanism one? You're kidding me. Wow, I just made all the steel for nothing. Okay, so that was a waste of time. <laughs> let's um <clears throat> let's just go ahead and make an iron set. <laughs> oh, I'm out of my element today, apparently. Apparently I'm not not uh not doing too hot today. Not paying much attention. There we go. Iron. Helmet. Always looks like a welding mask to me, unless you know, it's technically. But uh, and boots. Okay, let's see if this gets us a little bit closer. I should have known that leather armor wouldn't really have been any good in the nether. Okay, we're ready. Let's do this. Let's get back down there. I am determined to kill those ghasts. The ghasts. <laughs> Those blazes and get my stuff back. I'm still upset that that zombie pigman was mad at me. I, I try to be just so nice to those guys because they don't mean any harm. That's just like, it's like it's their home. I'm just a visitor. And I'm also irritated if it was that. Uh, oops, I went the wrong way. If it was that blaze that aggroed them to me because I didn't do anything to them. Which way am I going? Oh, it's not loading quite right. Okay, pretty sure it was this way. No? Okay, Chunks, why aren't you loading properly? What, a, what? What in the heck? Oh, it's over there. Okay. Man, I moved so slow without my exosuit on. This is crazy. I can jump through it, apparently. Oh, there's some of my XP. I really haven't been saving that at all this time, have I? Oh, great. There's a skeleton waiting for me, but you, I don't mind killing. <clears throat> Let's eat some jerky. Okay, here we go. Gotta be quick, gotta be fast. Wow. Okay, hurry up, quickly! Get your st oh, my tools and crap. No! I really don't want to die again. No, oh my god. Alright, well, I'm one step closer. <laughs> Alright, this time, let's see if I can do it without any help whatsoever. 
<laughs> At least I got my stuff further away. Except all my tools are still there, and they're... Oh, crap. They're going to despawn if I don't get there in time. Uh... <laughs> oh, my gosh. That would suck so bad. Now it's, now it's a matter of timing. Hopefully my sword came back to me. Let's see, the iron lasted a little bit longer, but that spawner drops like four at a time. It's ridiculous. And if anybody's seen my Galactic Quest series, you'll know this is kind of how it went with that the first time I went to the Nether in that series, too. Just get owned, except it's not... I don't even want to say what killed me last time, because I feel like I'll jinx it if I say it. But um, <laughs> none of those this time. This time it's something else altogether. Okay, let's see what we have. Let's take stock. You... Oh my, it's, yeah. By the way, this happens with gravestones. Skeletons will spawn near them. Yeah, you stay in that hole, big dope. Okay, boom, 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 boom. Okay, so I did get my exosuit back. So let's put stuff in my knapsack. Uh, take this off. What the heck? Oh. Put it. Where's my knapsack? What the heck? I had it and then I didn't. That's really weird. Okay, so let's put on. Let's put on what I can. Of my exosuit, the whole thing is on there. Okay, and where are the feet? All right. Uh, so let's get my stuff. Now I should be able to survive fairly well. Look at them. There's more and more every time I come up here. It's ridiculous. Oh, there's a special one, too. That's fantastic. Eat some jerky. Let's see. I don't need this. What What do I have in here that I don't need? I got some of my tools back, just not all of them. I don't need this. I don't need the one dirt. I want my knapsack back. I want to know why my knapsack glitched out. Did I drop it? That's so weird. Where's... It's that big jerk. Alright, did I get all my stuff? I got my tools, I think. Oh, did I get my sword? I did get my sword. I want to know where my knapsack is with all my stuff in it. I was able. That was so weird. It's like it was in my menu. I was able to get stuff in it, and then it wasn't. That's so strange. I think I might have just lost the stuff I put in there. I'm gonna have to rewind and see what's in there. All right, let's see. that? Oh, that's just whatever that mob dropped. Alright, let's get out of here. Oh, I've had enough of the nether for one day. It's not in this one. No, that was just the stuff I dropped. Okay! Well, I think we're going to call it a pseudo-success. I have... Wow, I got way more blaze rods now than I had before. Which is... Ow! I, oh, I'm the burning grass. I want to go home! <laughs> I want to go home! <laughs> Oh, man, oh, man. Okay, so I I'm going to call this a success because I got what I came for. Even though I died 8,000 times. Do I have my glider? I do have my glider. Okay, you know, this is <laughs> this has been crazy. <laughs> oh, I got an enchanted uh, chain chest piece from one of those guys. Big jerks. <laughs> got my... Okay, so I gotta organize my stuff, find out where my knapsack went, and why it appears to have glitched out. <coughs> Hopefully, uh, if I make another one, that it's whatever was in that inventory will still be there somehow. Um, otherwise, I'm gonna have to figure out what it is I'm missing, and I have to remake it, which stinks. Stinks, 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 stinks. But um, okay, thanks for watching, guys. <laughs> my debacle in the Nether, and um, oh. I don't know. You know, I feel like I forgot something. I know I did. I'm going to have to go back there. I just, I can feel it. That I'm going to have to end up going back there for something else. Um, so next time I'll be, I don't know, a little bit better prepared. Uh, so 
we'll see. Do I have? I do have my Ardite and Cobalt, which I might go back for. Um, so thanks for watching, guys. Please like and subscribe, uh, and stay tuned for more. Bye.